Ladies and gentlemen, we are back for round two of the 2023 Grand National Cross Country Racing Series. Palatka, Florida, they got sand. That's all they have. Well, they've also got these things called palmettos that have their own joints and fingers that reach up, grab your machine and pull it to the ground, but that's okay. Ladies and gentlemen, today, we are gonna separate the men from the boys, the women from the girls, the cream of the crop is gonna rise to the top, and it all starts right now at the Palatka GNCC. Let's do it! so I didn't make any silly mistakes and yeah it was just checking off laps I did what I came to do and everyone's complaining about the track and you can't come into it with a negative mindset so I was pumped all week and I'm, yeah I'm pumped this one was decent I got my knuckle a little bit the third lap uh, but this hand's good so I was throttle hand all day To endure the suffer. <laughs> suffer. Yeah. It's it's gonna be a suffer. It's hot. I think it's similar to last year. It's gonna be deep sand rolls for three hours. I got all these podcasts telling me I can't finish three hours, so I got to kind of finish three hours today. Thanks, man. I can't even tell you. <laughs> I'm just out here trying to do the best I can, and I love this track, but I know it's gonna be brutal. But I did well at Big Buck. We'll see what I can do today. Yeah. I don't know, I got no words that a PG to describe how it's going to be, I think. <laughs> it's going to be a hell of a time, though. It, it looks like an Aussie track, if you ask me. I don't know, we'll see about that. We'll see. We'll come back check in on, the, on that one later on. Here we are. Florida. How <laughs> to. Here's the motto of the weekend. Laps of beach dick. Just a stone's throw away from Daytona. We're having our own party here in Palaka, Florida. I'm going to ask you one more time. Are you ready to go? GNCC Racer! And here we go. Off the inside is Craig DeLong and Ricky Russell duking it out. Side by side now. Oh, how a 
about that. That's going to go to the 407. On the KTM right there. As we turn our attention now to the XC2 250 Pro Class. Here we go. That's going to be the 361 of Chris Canning on a Pilgrim Power Sports back gas gas out of Connecticut. down a little on the last lap comes in a little bit late compared to what he did but doesn't matter he knew exactly where he needed to be and there is the win for the 530 factory ktm ride of ben kelly brutal it's typical florida <laughs> i mean i love it it's so fun to ride but for three hours it's just miserable like you could go as fast as you want be super aggressive but you would just pop. There's not a chance you would make it, you know? Like we do 30 minute sprints and at the end of that, you're gassed, even more gassed than this. So you gotta figure out how to ride fast while saving energy and stay off the ground, stay moving forward. And uh, yeah, I'm happy to, happy to get it done. For the way that I rode, second place is solid. Cause I spent more time on the ground uh, than I have in a long time. Had some really, really big crashes just Life's a little bit unpredictable, but uh, not sure. Not sure what we could have done differently. Just uh, a lot of mistakes. Oh. Yeah, time, time for X-rays. It was good. It's always tough. I uh, I was pretty content running my pace the first two laps. And Ricky and them caught me, and they were pushing it pretty good. And I was uh, kind of caught me off guard a little bit. So I had to kind of regroup and uh, I got shuffled back, but I felt good. I, I kind of, I think I saved myself in the beginning, just riding smooth and Ricky kind of faded. So I was, I felt good. I just, uh, this place is always, uh, it's always nasty, man. It was gnarly. I had some redemption to get on this place. I've never done good, never fit. I don't think I've ever finished here. I've always just kind of floundered around and 
uh, couldn't ride the sand. Even though I'm from Jersey, I'm from the sand. I could never figure this place out, but my trainers, Caleb and Betty, they had me dialed, so uh, I'm super pumped. I feel like I, I earned this one straight up, controlled it from, uh, from the beginning, so I'm excited. Just take it race by race. I'm having fun. I know those guys are riding good as well, so. I'd love to see you talk. <laughs> yep. Thanks, man. Thank you. for your XC1 podium. It was hot, it was rough, it was tough, and they survived.